Right now, the Providence Teachers Union is holding another protest, this time outside the Department of Education. They're angry at issues allegedly experienced yesterday with the Providence Public Schools Virtual Learning Academy. 12 News reporter Sheena Losciuto is live in Providence with the latest on what's happening right now. Sheena? Yeah, I'm just going to zoom you guys in right away so you can take a look at everything that's going on. You can see there's a pretty decent crowd here. Providence police are also here blocking traffic and just kind of making sure everything stays under control. Now, according to the Providence Teachers Union, the majority of the people you see here, they're teachers. And they feel the way virtual learning is going right now is just not working for them. A big complaint. The Providence Teachers Union's president says some teachers are teaching classes of more than 50 students right now. So there's just been a lot of logistics. Logistical issues, she says. They do plan on addressing right officials at the meeting that's about to start in the next couple of hours. Our message to ride is stop pretending like everything is perfect. Let's be realistic and talk about how we have fundamental flaws in what's happening right now, and let's work together to see how we can provide the best possible education during a COVID pandemic for all of our students, whether they be at home or in the classrooms. Another issue. Now, the interview you just heard, we just spoke to the Providence Teachers Union president about 15 to 20 minutes ago. So this event just started at around 430. So what we're going to do now is go back over there. It sounds like there's a speaking portion. So we're going to just try to see what they're talking about. We'll bring any updates for you both on air and online at WPRI.com. Reporting live in Providence tonight, I'm Sheena Losciuto, 12 News.